What's the hold up there? Move your ass. Hey, Frankie. We got a little business to take care of here, huh? Why don't you go have a smoke? <laughs> yeah, sure. Have your fun, you sick bastard. Your scars, pretty boy. Where'd you get them? Sorry, asshole. You picked the wrong ass to drill. We can do this the easy way. Or the hard way. Your choice. I got a better idea. Why don't you go fuck your buddies instead? Or better yet, go fuck yourself. Okay. I guess you want it rough. Time. Let's dance, sweetheart. This could have been so much easier. Hurry up, John. We got more. It's party time. Let's dance, sweetheart. Oh. Hurry up, John. We ain't got more. <clears throat> Do that again, sweet cheeks. It's not. Oh, this guy's a fighter, huh? Hey! Whoa, whoa! What the hell's going on? Where's Frank? Gone, boy. You know the drill. Oh, and, uh, this came today. Might want to read it. Looks important. died while Francesca was visiting me. Instead of going toward a good doctor and a wedding gift, every penny I had went to the funeral. Mr. Galante wants to talk to you. Come with me. Good to have you back, kid. What the hell happened? It looks like the mix weren't up for a fair fight. A couple of them jumped Pepe yesterday. It was a lot more than a couple. Yeah, well, we sure as hell ain't gonna let this go. What do you got in mind? Pepe's got it all worked out. Took a little persuading, but O'Neill's all by himself right now in the gym. The guards won't be back for a while. You're just gonna give him a good beating, break a couple of bones, same as they did to me. Got it? Yeah, I got it. All right, come with me. Break a leg, kid. I'll wait out here. If the guards get back early, I'll warn you. Okay. All right, go for it.
Hey, O'Neill. I got a little business to settle with you. Just the man I wanted to see. Come here, Mary! I don't think so. No guards to save you this time. Again, harder. Oh, had enough? Get up, I'm not done with you. Oh, nice shot, Mary. Come here, Mary! Again, hard! Nice shot, Mary! Oh, me ma used to hit harder than that. Is that all you've got? I don't think so. Try again, little man. No guards to save you this... Jesus, what the fuck are you made of? Oh, you'll have to do better than that, little girl! This time I'll finish you! Huh, had enough? I'm not gonna be so gentle this time! It all worked out just fine. They never found out who did it. Leo arranged for me to relocate to his cell. Well, actually, it was more like a suite. Life was getting better by the minute. So, Vito, what do you plan on doing when you get out of this shithole? I don't know. I sure as hell ain't gonna go back to work on for Clemente, I can tell you that. Yeah, you're better off just forgetting about that old bastard. Trust me. Alberto's a real cocksucker, and you can bet that lawyer he's hired was just there to make sure you didn't rot. But don't worry. You'll get his. Letting guys into your family for money like he offered you is against the rules. He's gonna have a lot of explaining to do. To who? I thought Clemente was the boss. You obviously don't know how things work around here. You see, there's more than one family in Empire Bay. There's three. Each family controls their own neighborhoods. There's a system of rules, and if there's any disagreements, the bosses of all the families meet to work things out. That's the commission. Great, so what do I do now? Am I in trouble too? No, 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 nothing like that. You're young, you're smart, and you've proven you can keep your mouth shut. You're exactly the type of guy everybody wants working for him. Yeah, but I don't even know who these other guys are. There's two other bosses besides Clemente. One is Carlo Falcone. The other? Frank Vinci. Carlo is young and ambitious. The guy's a freaking nut job. He's new blood. Whereas Don Vinci is a man of honor. He respects the old ways. You know these guys? <laughs> you could say that. And Frank Vinci is consigliere. You think being just a regular old man gets you all this? But listen, Vito. I'm getting out in a few months. When I do, you'll see what we can do about... Adjusting your sentence. Pepe, come here. Have a taste.
Galante wasn't lying. He called in a few favors and arranged for me to get out early. Knocked almost four years off my sentence. Now, Joe used to come visit me and, you know, kind of film me in on what was happening on the outside. But I tell you, as soon as I walked out of that prison gate, it was like a whole new world.